<laughs> yeah, I know, right? So uh, let's do this problem. It says, uh, name the pictured alkane, okay? So uh, this is just an acyclic alkane. So when we're, look, when we're doing these acyclic alkanes, what do we need to do? Look for the, the longest, longest chain. chain, right? So you were pointing out earlier, you were like, well, do I have to go with the straight chain, or can I look for some other kind of branched part of the chain? And in fact, yeah, you're going to look for whichever one is the longest continuous chain. Okay, so we're going to count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So there's seven there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight there, right? Or if you did it this way, one, two, three, four, seven, eight, either way, okay? So eight is bigger than seven, right? So this is going to be um, called an octane, okay? Mm -hmm. So um, let's write that down, that part, octane. So hopefully you can see there's two substituents off the longest chain, right? Yes. One of them's here off this third carbon, and then the other one's here off this fourth carbon there, okay? So um, they're both one, two carbon units, right? So yes. two carbon units. So remember, a two carbon unit is called a what type of group? Two carbon unit out. And ethyl. ethyl group, right? Yeah, an ethyl group. So we've got an ethyl coming off the three and an ethyl coming off the four. So there's two ethyls, so this is a what? what how do we name that? Uh, di dimethyl, or diethyl. We've got to put that di in front of there, okay? So since it's coming off the three and four carbon, we'll say three, four, diethyl. Di Okay, and that's the name of this molecule. Now remember, if you accidentally labeled this from the wrong way, right, same. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. You see that the ethyl groups are coming off five and six now, right? Remember, we want the smallest numbers here. So three and four is smaller than five and six. So if you accidentally put five and six, five, six diethyl octane, right, the other one, compare it to the other one, and that way you can see, okay, yeah, three, four is bigger than, or smaller than five, six, so we're gonna cancel that one. Okay, so let's erase it. So are there any questions on this one? When you're naming an alkane, you will only incorporate the trans and cis prefixes when it is a cyclic chain? chain? Uh, yeah, so the trans and cis uh, won't apply to these uh, acyclic alkanes because you can have free rotation around a single bond. So um, let's say, molecule here that I can show you. Right, if we look at these, if we look at these two um, methyl groups on this molecule here, then why don't we kill this one and we'll talk about that in a different video, okay? okay.